Hi, my name is Viola Llewellyn, and I am the co-founder and president of Avamba Solutions Inc., which is a trade tech company founded by my business partner and myself. Marvin Cole and I started the company here in Maryland in 2013. Very excited to be presenting this white paper to the University of Michigan and the Central Bank of the Future, and it's about the sustainable growth in sub-Saharan Africa. This paper was written by uh, Fanny Fofu, one of my team members, and myself, and is designed to focus and look at new ways for regarding financial depth and financial inclusion in sub-Saharan Africa, and a new approach that involves an inventory-centric um, perspective versus just a customer or SME perspective. In the paper, we take a deeper dive into the central bank, their policies around monetary policy, and its effects on SMEs, who are largely excluded from bank services, and the role that banks play in accidentally leaving these, these SMEs out because of the lack of digital infrastructure or alternative finance methods of looking at risk and how to help businesses. In our paper, we provide an argument based on our years of beta testing in Cameroon and Ivory Coast, a way in which to create um, a view of SMEs that puts inventory at the center, which in our opinion only makes sense in that financial depth is something that is best addressed from the standpoint of that part of GDP that is most active, and that is traders, those businesses that are buying and selling something. We also examine the opportunities for helping central banks with policy support, dashboards, digital uh, innovations and data to help them see last milers and those at the bottom of the pyramid who are actually uh, per capita applying the most of their efforts to supplying the growth required in these economic systems and in these countries. We're really excited about this. We know that it will make a great read. It involves looking at the challenges, the failures, and the opportunities for these banks to reduce the non-performing loan portfolios, the management of liquidity, and how to help businesses to achieve real growth, and the data that comes back to central banks to support the policies that will affect the entire perspective around central, um, around financial inclusion and financial debt. Again, this, this paper was written by myself, Viola Llewellyn, and Fanny Fofu. Very excited to be providing it. And it comes at the end of a long two years of beta testing different types of transactions and scenarios in sub-Saharan Africa and has produced a commercial product that has proven to reduce non-performing loans um, by as much as 3 to 4% in portfolios that are mainly focused on uh, traders, women, and other members of Africa's very wide and varied economic um, landscape. Excited to be doing this. Thank you so much. We hope that you enjoy the reading and we look forward to engaging central banks on the policies that we think will best suit their ability to manage the economy. Thank you so much.